Hey, what's up, YouTube? Sugar Wolf here, along with my boyfriend, Fang. Yeah, sorry it's been a little while. I uh, know we haven't made a video for you guys in a bit, but we had to take this opportunity because we got a couple of our friends visiting us right now this week. So, over here we got Dyrex, our uh, longtime friend, aka Draco the Dragon, who we finally got to meet in person this week. How's it going, buddy? I'm going to doing pretty well. How about yourself? I'm doing pretty well. Doing, doing even better now that you're here. Yeah. yeah. And we've also got his boyfriend, Ator, here with us today. So, a little story about Ator. Uh, he has never worn a fursuit before today. So, today's the first time we ever got him in one. And he is wearing Fang's suit, Zephira. And I can tell he's having a blast. You doing yourself there? Feeling good? Awesome. Anyway, uh, we're going to be playing a little game for you guys today. Uh, it's called Would You Rather. So. Uh, you might be familiar with it, and you may have seen other furries on YouTube playing this before. So what we're going to be doing is playing a game on a website where you're given two options. You know, it's like, would you rather do this or rather do this? And we're each going to give our answer, and we're going to see what the majority of individuals answered for this particular question. And if our answer is not with the majority of everyone else, we lose a life. And we're all starting with five lives. Five. There we go. That's fine. <coughs> and the loser has to be on the bottom of the uh, fur pile. <laughs> Alright, so are we ready? Yes. Yep. Alright. I'm going to attempt to control the screen that we have on the TV here. I'm broadcasting from my phone. Wait, wait, whose bang is that? Of course oh. it's the squeaker, so he can squeak him louder. That's how he squeaks! That's how I squeak is drink some energy drinks. That's how Fang squeaks is the thing. The more he drinks, the louder he is. Oh, uh, I'm, I'm confiscating all this now. Uh-huh. Yes. Alright. I'm trying to read this on my phone that's over here. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> all right, so here's our first question for today. In an unlucky survival situation, would you rather go swimming with sharks or go swimming with alligators. Sharks. Oh, wow. That's kind of scary. Now you said sharks? Yes. Why sharks? You were pretty quick to jump on that. Okay, there's a few reasons. Because uh, one, what I've been told, I'm not sure if it's true, but like maybe seals actually swim with sharks and they have a lot of the same on there. They, really? te they teach you how to swim with sharks and if one does charge at you, you punch it in the nose and it'll leave you alone. <laughs> It's so, like a Tomb Raider. I was gonna say, that, that sounds like Tomb Raider, man. Is that a real thing? I'm pretty sure it is. What do you two doing there? Hey, we're gonna separate you two. Yes. Yeah, see, I'll, I'll take this one, and uh, you're gonna take that one. Uh, yeah. There we go. There you go. Alright, so I guess Lara Croft didn't know what she was doing then. Yeah, that's a Navy SEAL thing? Uh, for I've been told, it's either just a Navy or Navy SEAL. I believe you. This uh, is all a military fur over here, by the way. Hoorah. Which would I rather do? Um, you know, there's a lot of sharks that won't even eat humans. Yeah. Or, or wolves. And his, his, or his, his, his <laughs> thing though, if you swim slowly enough in the water, they won't attack you because uh, they actually hunt by movement. And if you like, yeah. like swim, like panic and stuff, they will charge at you. Just look at the Meg. Remember the, remember the Meg? I think I do remember the Meg. I don't know, alligators scare me anyway, so I think I would say sharks. Okay, so shark, 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 shark. Sharks all the way shark, around. Shark what do we got here? And holy shit! I percent agree with us. Yep, alright, so none of us lost the life there. Yay! Alright, we're all sitting here. I got five. Still at five. Okay, would you rather be able to run 40 miles per hour or own a car? I mean, I don't even own a car right now since mine blew up. Mm. Yeah, would you want to though, if you could? Yeah. You'd rather I, I would say car, honestly. Yeah. Uh, let me think about this, because, like, I've always said for the longest time, if I could get away without having a car, I would. Because insurance, car payments, gas, and everything like that. But okay, that's true. That's true. But that's only 40 miles an hour, though. I, I feel like that's not efficient enough. It's not a good enough trade off. Yeah. Maybe, maybe if I could run 60 miles an hour. Go full Sonic the Hedgehog there. Yeah, I'm gonna say own a car. Okay, we all got to Everybody on the says own the car? Okay. Alright, yeah, let's see what we car. got here. Um, oh my oh. god! Epic fail. <laughs> that is so bad. 
Really? All right, it breaks down to four, right? Yes. Okay, next one. Would you rather be the homemaker or be the breadwinner? Well. Okay, I think homemaker is like what, a stay-at-home wife or husband? And then the breadwinner is the one who works, basically. Oh. Uh, I'd rather be the breadwinner. I don't know. I, I don't think I'd want to, you know, stay home and take care of the house. I'd be the one who wants. I'd want to be the one who works. I can't talk. Yeah, yeah I'm gonna be the, the same way. I'm gonna be the one that works. Yeah. Okay. So we all vote breadwinner. All right. So we're either all safe. We're all gonna lose another life. Let's see. What's that say? Fifty-five percent. Cool. All right. Next one is. Would you rather go toe to toe with Michael Myers or try to take down Freddy Krueger? Oh dang! I don't know anything about Michael Myers. I just know he was mask and kills. That's it. That's and real. Freddy Krueger, I know he's not. He was real, but they killed him and only enters the minds of like teenagers and kills them. Right, well, both of them. What's the deal? I think in the movies, I've, I've only seen a couple of the movies. Like they both can't be killed. I've never seen either one. So you're kind of boned either way. I don't know. I mean, is there an advantage to going toe to toe with one of them? You'd just be able to say you went toe to toe with a legendary uh, horror villain. Oh, which one's more legendary? Uh, they're both like uneven keel. I don't know. Michael Myers, he does his kills like painfully. Freddy Krueger, I don't know anything about. I'm not how he kills his victims or anything like that. So he kills his victims in dreams. Like he, how's that uh, even possible? Yeah, you uh, you start having nightmares of like. You know, kids playing jump rope saying, one and two, Freddy's coming for you. And then he uh, starts stalking you in your dreams and slashing you and stuff. Kind of sounds like uh, Scary Terry. Yeah, Rick Scary Terry is, is, a, is a spoof of that. Yeah. Yeah. You know what, I, I think I'm going to say Freddy Krueger just because the few times that I have seen him, like in my head, I thought like, man, I, I want to take him down just because he stalks you, he taunts you. You know, Mike Myers kind of just walks around menacingly and then, you know, stabs you and stuff, right? I guess Freddy Cougar. Is everybody else doing? This way? So you're both going Mike Myers? Oh, we got a split vote here. Uh -oh. Alright, so two of us are about to lose a life. Who's it going to be here? Yeah. Ooh! Mm -hmm. Fuck. on it. 57% said Mike Myers. Okay. So we're down to three. Yeah. yeah. Okay, we're planning our comeback now here. Oh boy. Alright. Would you rather watch Are You Afraid of the Dark or read Goosebumps? What's Afraid of the Dark? Okay, so, so this uh, you probably don't know because you're not a 90s kid, but that was a show on Nickelodeon for many years. It, it was a scary show where uh, kids got together, grounded around a campfire, and told scary stories. And then you would see like actors portraying the story. It was really cool. Okay, then I'm going to say re read Goosebumps. You're going to say Goosebumps? Yes, Goosebumps. You know what? I read a few Goosebumps, but I grew up loving Are You Afraid of the Dark? So I, I love Goosebumps. I love those books. I, I gotta let my inner 90s kid out here and vote for that. Vote for I, I, I think uh, a tour is with me. I think everybody's with you. Alright. Let's see who's right about this one. And... Oh! Come on! It's a classic! Who even reads anymore? Is that even still a thing? Yeah, you heard me. I may what? not, I may not read, but I still listen to audiobooks. So I guess that's the new reading, isn't it? Yes. Now here's yeah. the thing, though. I, I, I will start a book, but I will stop within like ten minutes because I can't focus enough to read the book. But if I listen to it, then I can stay with it. But would you listen to Goosebumps on audiobook? Yes. You would. Yes. <laughs> You'd rather really do that than watch a TV show. Why? I got, I got punched in the face. I, I think he's trying to tell you something. I don't, don't know. What are, you, what are you trying to say? I think he's saying no. Listening is good. It helps me get through it. Yes. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Alright, so two, three, four, four. I think that's cheating. Probably. The, the the two ones who don't talk are cheating here. Yes. I, I, they're both winning. I, I See? Guess he's cheating. doing that. That shows you that he's cheating. He is an evil dog. Alrighty, would you rather cure cancer or make first contact with an alien race? Cure cancer. Yeah, I, I think I'm all over that. Yeah. I, I don't know. I mean, I guess I've seen first contact by Star with Star Trek, and who knows? Maybe that might open up the door to new exploration. Oh, also the movie Paul. 
Oh, it's basically two guys go to Comic Con, and then after that they went to go see Area 51. And as they were leaving, an alien named Paul escaped Area 51, and they needed that, his, their help to get home. Wow. Okay. But by meeting you know, Paul, you know, do you know the movie? Yeah, he knows it. Okay. But by meeting Paul, though, did anything significant happen? Like, no. I mean, he brought a dead board, uh, bird back to life. Also, a dead guy back to life. Oh, okay. So maybe there's a potential to cure and, cancer uh, anyway, and meet aliens. Oh, right. Which reminds me, uh, when he brought the bird back to life, he ate it. Okay. That's a good in there. <laughs> yeah, I, I think that seals my answer there. I'm gonna say cure cancer. Cure cancer. Here. All right. Let's see if we're all safe or not. Yeah! Holy! For F! 71 to 29 is that? 29. Wow. Okay. But at least not everyone's a complete a-hole. <laughs> Just because they voted hey, for the other one might not be an a-hole. He cursed! Yes. He cursed and squeak, I can tell. Oh. Did, yes. Did you cuss and, and squeak? I don't believe you. Yeah, you, you should be ashamed. See, they have a secret alliance. That's how they're winning. Yeah, that's okay. That's not going to help them. We'll come back. Uh-huh. <laughs> All right. If you were to bet your life savings on a single... <laughs> single roulette spin, would you... I'm going to read this. Would you rather bet, bet it on, on black, black or, or on red? That, that's completely out the chance. That's complete 50-50. I know. Wow. Um... I would... I would just put it on red because it's the closest one to orange. Yeah. I'm gonna go with black because my fursuit's black. Everything's going black? I'm going black because I'm black. Alright, alright. That, that was wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you just stayed black there. <laughs> That's not wrong if it's a fact. I mean, my, my, my fursuit's black. Yeah, so, so you're black. Oh, that's going to See, I knew you were lying. You're totally cussed and squeak. Uh huh. He 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 cursed three times. Mm. Oh, three times. So there's three times I don't know that. Or he admits it. He admits it. He admits it. Bad boy. <laughs> you better punish him later. Yeah. Better put him in his cage. Pop you on the snow. All right. So. This What's is my chance to come back, so I, I hope you all agreed with me on this one. You voted for the closest thing that won. I'm going back. Let's go red. Oh, look at that! <laughs> yes! This is not going well for me. No, it's not. 53 to 47. Ay, ay, ay. Alright, down to my last life. I swear to God, these two are cheated. They have a secret alliance. Uh-huh. I heard you. Yeah, come on. Thanks for reminding me. <laughs> Would you rather eat a hot dog or eat a hamburger? I know his. I know that one's answer. He All likes right. eating dogs. Too. Is that a no? No, I said he likes to eat dogs. <laughs> what, are you, what are you pointing at? You're just randomly squeaking. Right, are you pointing to the right? I'm going with hamburgers. Yes. You're all, you're all going hamburgers. Yes. All right. What would I rather do? Eat a dog. I don't really eat hots or hamburgers much anyway. You know what? When I do go to a restaurant, if I have the option, usually I'll order a hamburger. So, yeah, I'll agree with all of y'all. All right, hamburger. I'll I'll just trying to drag me down here. All right, so what do we got? There yeah. we go. No. All right. All right. 74%. Let's see if I can keep going here. Would you rather ski in the mountains or vacation on the beach? Ski in the mountains. Yeah, totally. Wow, everybody agrees on that? Yep. Yeah, you don't like being hot? Yeah, no, I, I agree with you. I, I mean, he's not hot anyway, so... Uh-huh. <laughs> Three of us are wolves here. Don't, wouldn't we rather be in the mountains in the snow any hot? <laughs> Careful, don't get us in trouble. Let's see if I'm still alive or if you guys are all dragging me down with you. Oh my god! No! <laughs> I, no! <laughs> How? Wow. How? That's bad. 71%. I guess people don't like the cold. I guess not. Yeah, people would rather be on a beach. Yeah, how many people voted for this anyway? 762,000 versus 311,000. Oh, uh, yo, idiots! Thanks, all you beach dwellers. Now I gotta be at the bottom of a fur pile because of all of you. Yeah! 
you know, you're all in it. Give me so much better. I just got. I got. I was done. I'm done. done uh, uh, two lives. All right. So I lost, and Direx was not far behind me. Uh, but anyway, uh, these two non-talkers over here want to see which one of them gets to be on top. So we're going to have a, a sudden death round here. So these two will play each other. First one to lose a life loses it. All right, you ready? Now uh, let's see who wins: the annoying squeaker or the cute mute. <laughs> cute mute. I like that. I know. All right, on December 21st, 2012, would you rather... Oh, so this is like, this is an old question. It's really relating to the Mayan apocalypse. Uh, would you rather there be a zombie apocalypse or an alien invasion? I know I, I'm not doing this, but I would say zombie apocalypse. Yeah, I, I agree. Because yeah. you can kill zombies. I've seen too many alien movies. Yeah. Where, like, we can't fight back. Look at, it, look at aliens in the xenomorph. Right. <laughs> yeah, so... Both voting for zombie apocalypse. All right, let's see what we got here. Oh yeah. my god! Sixty percent agree with you. All right, they're both still alive. Moving on. Would you rather always drive under the speed limit or always drive over the speed limit? <laughs> All shamefully pointing to the right. I would say over. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I, I gotta agree. Yeah, you can go one mile over, right? It's not. I go five. Uh, five. Well, don't be all shameful. I agree with you. Yeah, you're you're really thinking hard on this one. Is it because of your job? <laughs> oh, yeah, because they'll know if you speed, right? Yeah. So he he drives for UPS, and uh, they know everything from how fast he's going to where he is to if his seatbelt is buckled or not. So. Are you serious? Yeah. They're wow. They're always watching you. He doesn't want to get in trouble here. Is that right? All right. They both say over. Oh my god! Wow! 56% wow. said under. That's interesting. <laughs> he was going to go with the left! Yeah. You, you were thinking about it. You could have won. See, that's what you get for breaking the law. <laughs> okay. Would you rather perform petty thievery for a living or perform grand larceny for a living? What the hell is larceny? Well, it's stealing. So grand larceny is stealing something worth a thousand dollars or more. Oh, I would go with larceny because if I'm going to steal something, I'm going to make some money off of it. Go big or go home, right? Yeah, pretty much. He agrees with you, and he's saying petty thief. Oh, know. here we go. I don't know what I would do in this situation. It's like if you make a living as a petty thief, no. You would, if you make pretty, if you're like a petty thief, you steal like you steal like maybe ten to fifty bucks. Now larceny thief, you go like a grand or. Yeah, like, but, like a jewelry shop or something like that. But it'd be easier to get caught, I think. Yeah. yeah. Uh, all right, all right. So, so you voted Grand Larceny. All right. So we're about to find out who our winner is here. Survey says <coughs> sixty-two says Grand Larceny. Wow. All right. So I guess Finn gets to be on top of the fur pile here. Okay. So I lost. So all right. Don't care for me. Not too hard anyway. All right. We doing this. Alright, do your worst. <laughs> 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 yep, so this is a thing. Yeah. Well, this was fun. Yeah, this this not so much I can get out. Yeah. Cut it out. I don't know who that is, but I think I can guess. Boy. Yeah. Alright. Yeah. Well, anyway, thanks for checking this out. Hope you guys enjoyed this as much as we did. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. We love you guys. And we'll catch you next time. Peace out. I don't know if everybody was on like one centralized spot, but I couldn't breathe there for a second. I'm like, <laughs> yeah, I felt so bad. Like, oh, crap. <laughs> okay. Hey, I actually do that a lockdown, so I actually have a first suit. And he does it. Does he have a blue suit? I don't remember. Baby. What is this? Does Lorcan have a blue suit? I don't remember. No, I, I guess he's on top. I think he just was. I just stayed in the bag. And besides, no. he, I know for a fact... me. And besides, I know for a fact he'd like to be on top. Careful, don't get us in trouble. Oh.
Everybody shut up. CPD is going to be at our door before long here. That was pretty cute, actually. That was cute. And there's going to be a dragon in a second. Yep, there's a dragon part. I mean, if I was a, like, a bit more optimistic today, I would say run. But I'm not, so I went with on a car. <laughs> is that because you lost the race today? I beat that one. I beat all of you with everything else. It was just the running I couldn't then do. You, you talk smack to me. You were saying like Air Force sucks and everything like that. You said that you could beat me in a race. I said I could beat you with anything else but running. I, I don't remember that. I do. I remember you saying we were going to have like this race at Anthrocon and everything. Yeah, along with that, we were going to have the whole PT test. Oh my uh, that includes push-ups and sit-ups yeah, and right. the two-mile run. All right, all right. All right, but we're all down to four lives now. And we've proven that the Army is better than the Air Force yeah, for yeah. a lot of things. I, I'll keep letting you think that. <laughs> he who controls the skies controls the battlefield. No. Yes. No, right. that is not how that works. Alright. Pause. Time out. Motherfucking motherfucker. Where's the fucking shit? What's that? Fucking squeaker fucking destroyed itself several times in my fucking mouth. Wow. If you last thing, I can totally up at that and play the role. <laughs> 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 I most of you have the. I have the blue that he's once. Go ahead. Kaiser. Hi, Kaiser. Hi, Kaiser. Down. Oh my god. It talked. <laughs> oh, yeah. I just heard you say Kaiser. Down. You sure it wasn't your imagination? I'm fine. You good? Yeah. For now. Kyler, come on. So, I guess Finn gets to be on top. Go the fur pile here. Uh, I'm just gonna say, yeah, squeak is, it sounds like a squeak is going now. <laughs> okay, I'm really going now. Alright, I, I think you said it with that squeaker. Yeah. Can, don't you have another one? At least you didn't just swallow it. Don't, don't, you, have a, don't you have another squeaker? He's got like 10 of them downstairs. Doesn't feel like going again. Again. <sighs> All right.